In this episode, we're going to be looking for the fourth streamer in our Paper Mario Origami King adventure. And to do this, we need to go through the Great Sea. What lies in store for us in the Great Blue Horizon? Find out in this episode. But before you do, you know, like and subscribe too. Helps out the channel, helps out the algorithm, you know, means a lot to me. The plugs are done and the premise is set. So here we go. Oh, 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 it's still playing. <laughs> oh, oh, everyone's vibing too. That's so cool. Oh, this guy's kept. Hello? Don't worry, I'm laminated! <laughs> don't worry. I don't think you need to worry about that here. I know I went through the like pre recorded intro. This time I actually did it pre recorded. But hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario the Origami King. Oh, this guy's hanging on the wall like a cool dude. Welcome to Shroom City, previously known as Sniff City, previously known as Shroom City. True. Okay, so with that being said, I have no idea how this game works again. Because I'm... Are you kidding me? Because I'm pretty sure the game usually explains where to go next before. Wait, 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 wait. I remember now. We have to go over to the sun altar, right? Oh my god, what is that? Look at this, you two! The altar is opened up to reveal some kind of entrance! This may contain what I have been seeking! Proof of the ancient ones themselves! Wait until they hear about this back at the university! I'm not sure what the professor is talking about, but I'm sure glad he's so happy. For some reason, I can't do my toad voice today. Now then! Let's hurry inside! Yeah, cause like, now that we're done with the streamer, I guess this is just this like, extra side bit, right? Oh, hold on. Hey, guys, is it absolutely freezing in here, or is it just- <laughs> I like how Mario and Olivia are just freezing, meanwhile there's Professor Toad here. He hasn't caught the memo that we're no longer in the desert anymore. We have now descended below its surface, where the sun's warming rays cannot reach us! Makes sense. Actually, the mere lack of sunlight cannot explain this degree of chill! I retract my explanation! What in the name of peer-reviewed study is that?! Oh, I, I guess he's just- Oh! Oh! What are all these fridges doing here? The refrigeration technology on display is more sophisticated than I could have ever imagined! I don't think this is part of the ancient ones. There's someone in there! Judging by the distinctive red spot- Well, you know, as distinctive as it can get. And an unmistakable cloak! Oh, oh, okay, I see it. Are those ribs on the side? It's Captain- What? He's really real- Oh my god, this is the Avatar, what the hell? What's this guy doing in the iceberg? Oh, well, I guess he's just- Okay, that's not helping. Uh... Oh, yeah, I don't know why I didn't think of that. Play the fire bending me, you- Oh no, Mario! We'll do a little jog, it's okay. Okay, now we can play the fire-bending music! You know, I just thought about it. What if we almost burned him? Wait, is this guy like the caveman of his time? Wait, I'm gonna be- Is this the ancient one? Should I try heating it up with fire again? No, no, I think it's good. Oh, 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 wait, no, he's okay. Oh, wait, <laughs> the coin too, just to show that we saved him. That's clever. That won't be necessary. Burn not paper with fire, lest ye yourself become singed. <laughs> True? He's alive, and he speaks the same language as us. Kind of? I am indeed the Toad, known as Ode Captain T. Ode, to be precise. I have survived the interminable passage of eons here in this arctic prison. Now, I am free! Of course! Mario! Olivia! I think he means Captain T. Ode! Wait, what makes you say that? He's Captain T. Ode, remember? I can finally say I've been the real- Oh, okay, so this is one of them. Oh my god, so d did he actually get frozen in the iceberg like a hundred years ago too? There is a simple question that has plagued researchers and archaeologists for time immemorable! Immemorial! We have studied the diet of the- What? The diet of the ancients based on art- Are you asking them what they ate a hundred years ago? I don't know if it's a hundred years ago, I'm kind of just going with the bit here. How did you take your- Oh my god. Cream and three I like how he just answers that so casually. Three sugars? It's beyond my wildest imagination! You know, I'm not gonna lie. 
Mine too. You ancient ones have probably forgotten more about coffee than we will ever know. <laughs> what does that mean? He seems to remember it just fine. My work here is done. Oh no, is he gonna leave us? Wow, coffee with Sarisha. <laughs> She's still hung up on that. Oh, I guess it's not that interesting. <laughs> hey, he's been working his entire life for this moment right here. You can at least give him his moment. Anyway, why do you seem so sad, Mr. I mean... He looks like he's smiling. In this moment, I am as a bird in a cage. I yearn to sail free at the helm of my merino. I thought he was gonna say like Mario or something. Do you know about the super marine? Okay, they definitely knew what they were doing with that name. That's so weird. How did you get to the musée already? So my merino rests in a musée as you call it. It is no place for her adventurous her. I mean, even in French, boat is masculine. You have my thanks, strange one. And uh, there it goes. Oh wait. Oh, <laughs> it was hard for me to understand anything he was saying. I guess that's ancient language for you. I don't think he is from an ancient civilization anymore. Sorry to interrupt, but I haven't made an archaeological discovery in over five minutes. I'm just kidding. A little academic humor. Oh, thank you both for all of your help. You've made my dream come true. No, we should be thanking you. You are such a big help in the desert. That's true, actually. Hopefully we won't need him for any extra, like, stuff, right? Because a lot of the collectibles, we had to dig them up, right? So now then, should we head out to try and find the next streamer? Uh, what? Mario? What's that all about the purple streamer and the great sea? Oh, yeah, she would be not knowing of that because yeah what's the great sea where is it ah olivia may i tell you about a game called the legend of zelda phantom hourglass oh and there we go 100 percent of toads rescued well he still seems to be following us but uh whoa 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 what was that it'd be cool if we at least kept someone right well uh i guess we can just go to the Great Sea then. Maybe Professor Toad can make more discoveries there too. I don't know why, but this part just feels so nostalgic for some reason. Oh, oh, uh, why don't I wait here for you? Oh, wait. Okay, so he doesn't come with us, but if we missed anything for like completion or something, we can just join him again. I hope he doesn't like sit there because I don't think we're going to be back in the desert for a while. I'd feel bad if he just sits there in the heat for all this time. So I guess he's permanent in the sense that he'll stay with us only when we're in the desert. Okay, that's cool too. Thank you for your service. I will leave this to you. What the heck are these boxes here for? Decoration? They kind of stand out a little. Doesn't seem to be anything up there. Uh, and uh, the toad's here still. Oh, we can ride the Eddie Rapper Rapid Rivers again. Or I think it's just like Eddie River isn't it? Well, anyway, we can just go to Toad Town. Uh, poor Toad has to go upstream. Wait, can I just take the pipe back? I'm gonna ask for your services again, and we'll just take this back. You think you would have said the same thing if we entered the warp pipe from the desert? Oh, oh yeah, he's here. Ah, you're back! Shall we? All right, so I guess he just waits around here, but uh, unfortunately we do have to move on. All right, yeah, so there's six worlds, but five streamers. So six, I assume, takes us to Peach's castle. Oh, there we go. The Super Marino, that's it. Guess we'll be seeing him eventually, I guess. Oh, wait, hold on. Can we get something extra here? I think now we might as well just get shiny and flashy stuff. And then we seem to be pretty good on shiny and flashy boots. Oh, we do have shiny fire flowers now. They are expensive as hell though, probably because you know oh yeah that guy's still up with the happy music and all how the hell do we get up there anyway anyway bad shop is somewhere around here or the accessory shop excuse me oh you've lowered the price okay Ooh. guess we can get the silver guard plus you know get it while it's cheap you know get it while it's cheap and all then we'll get the gold time plus and there's the alley tambourine that we could take advantage of at some point whenever we get another partner all right oh okay 20 percent on discount Oh, so you can only have like two at a time, I think. Unless we find another shop, if I remember to use the membership card, right? Yo, wait. How did Luigi get across? Oh, hello? There's a sniffet back there. Oh, is that how we get up there? Oh, there we go. Well, all the turtles are back. I guess the line for the sewer is going to be out of control again. What? Was this guy just stuck here this entire time? There's a sticker up there. There's a door. There's this... 
very hyper realistic toad painting here for some reason oh oh so there's a sticker there and then that's the door but there's another sticker there which i assume opens up the staircase so we can go back up there from the outside wait wait oh, wait yeah, okay, they cheese-proofed it. Is there really no other way we can get up there? Do I get, like, Yoshi Flutter similar to Thousand Year Door or something? Whoa, whoa, where does this take us? Oh, Overlook Mountain. Oh, is that the one at the... for World 1? Oh, it is! Okay. Anyway, <laughs> without further ado, let's actually go to the boat now. Off we go, baby! Woo! Na -na 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 -na. Wow, the Great Sea is so big! This breeze feels so good! Why does it smell so salty? The only word you could use to describe it is EPIC! Well, that ain't great, I guess. And there we go, the purple streamer. Oh, hello? Ah, uh, I dropped that splosh! A fat sack of precious coins ran into the old drink. Oh no! Does that mean I can, like, salvage our man? <gasps> this really is Phantom Hourglass! Oh, well, there we go. How are we supposed to follow it down there? Good, good question. Oh, there's the Princess Peach. Well, not the actual princess, but, you know. Oh, wait. Oh, does it go back up? Wait. And there's a waterfall? Oh, wait, no, no, it's just fog. Whoa, a vest! A uh, cutscene? Okay, hold on. This fog is unbelievable. Can't see through it at all. We just get lost in that mess. Better turn- Okay, yeah. Ah, what it painted the board bow! Wish we had a sea chart! Where the hell are we gonna find a sea chart? Oh. You two ever heard the legend of the legendary captain? Oh! We haven't only heard it. We met him. Oh, Mom, Benny! Oh, are we supposed to use the Saint Maria or whatever it was? <laughs> the Saint Maria. Was it like the Super Maribo? Mar- Mar- Marlio? Marino? Marino is probably it. We know that guy. He said he'd be at the museum. Okay, yeah, so. Ah, you jokers! That must be the most ridiculous fib I've ever heard! I mean, yeah, we haven't seen him in the last, like, a hundred years, right? You're serious? <laughs> well, what are we waiting for? Let's head straight for that museum! Oh, and there's also another port there, but I don't know how to get there. I think I get there through that red building, or... Hold on. Oh! Oh, what the heck? Oh, hello? It's ready. Are you ready? For what? Collectible treasures? Wait. Oh, for the bosses. Do I like collect them? I like how the rubber band is so dirt cheap compared to the others. Gee, Monty Mole, I can't believe they let you have three Yusuke's. Oh wait, there's no water here. What? Where is Purple Toad? I think the real question is where'd the water go? Huh? I thought Ta Captain Tio would be here to greet us. He's... He's not real, you know. Quite colorful to be sure, but imaginary. Oh, well, I don't know about- oh. <laughs> He just pops out! Nah, my precious Marino. Still beautiful, still formidable. And yet, time marches on. Museum receptionist, meet Captain Tioid. So, did you find the, uh, thing you were looking for? The sea chart? Oh, I guess he was looking for the sea chart? I thought he was looking for the- Captain Marino. <laughs> what is lost may never be found. All that remains is a shattered reflection like a teardrop in a pond. But yes, I have the sea chart. A submarine on a boat? Two famous captains? I can't wait. What about my exhibit? It's the star attraction. I can curate something else out of thin air. Alrighty, you should be good to go here. You decide you want to rig up a few more out boots? Give that vessel. Oh wait, oh, is this the guy that did the boot car and everything? So I guess we can upgrade the submarine now if we wanted to. And you may now have this. Let's go, the sea chart! That's it, there is no disputing the ancient text. The Marino is yours, Captain. I wish you good luck and tons speed! And if you should choose to return to my humble museum at any time, I will gladly offer you a personal tour! I mean, yeah, I think that's one of the things we can do in this game as well, right? I don't know if it's like the sticker museum where you collect all of these, like, collectible treasures for it. Are they collectible treasures for the museum? Alright, well, I guess it's time to go underwater. Oh. Oh, no. Well, I mean, yeah, there's a skull, right? But I think I'm more worried about the gooper blooper on the bottom right. It's mostly blank right now, but I'll add any new art. Oh, okay. So it is sort of like Phantom Hourglass or Wind Waker. I don't know. I haven't played Wind Waker yet. I've already mapped one island on this sea. I named it Bonehead Island. 
Oh, so I guess it's just a skull-shaped island? Bonehead Island is said to hide a secret tied to the fog. Oh, okay, so this is like a plot point. Yeah, Bonehead Island, here we come. All right, but before we do that, hello? What? Oh, 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 there it is. Okay, so literally, oh, wait, what? Okay, now grab hold. Oh, and then we pull back. A shy guy's precious keepsake. Let's try to return it, damn. My whole plot point was to rob him. Better not peek. <laughs> Mario looking at me like, you better than give it the bag. <laughs> you found it and you didn't keep it? Amazing, please take this reward for being so trustworthy. Yep, me. Oh, wow, okay. I'll never let this huge sack of coins out of my sight ever again. He's gonna lose it again, isn't he? All right, well, I guess it's time to head to- Okay, not the Cooper blooper. Oh, hello. Oh, okay, so- <laughs> Wow, a creepy skull. True. Okay, yeah, so it is just ominously in this ring. The Marino can't dive with all this fog. Oh, okay. Wait, what do you mean? We're in, like, the middle of- no fog. Maybe this is his way of saying, don't do it here. Oh shoot, it's the, the birds from New Super Mario Bros. Is it just me or is that big ugly sc I don't think you should be calling it ugly, Olivia. Don't surrender to fear. You must explore this island. Secrets await. And I want to hear what they are. Oh, are they gonna swoop just like the freaking New Super Mario Bros? I don't know if they're in like another game, but New Super Mario Bros is like the only 2D platformer of new that I... That is weird to say. Well, I've played them, but I haven't, like, beaten them. Fun, funky, and functional! Walk 10,000 steps with this and you'll be rewarded? Alright, I'll take it. Okay, so we only can wear two. Well, the pedal bag stays on. Okay, so yeah, it does count. Alright, well, I guess we can leave this on while we explore. Yeah, I'm exploring. Oh, this is just an opening, okay. There is this back here, though. Oh, this is either a cafe or a fax machine. Okay, it's the cafe. Oh! Huh. Oh my god, the even here is spooky too. What the hell? Okay. Oh, we have a bone for it too. What the problem is, Mario? You know, like, spoon? Oh. Well, it's an interesting spoon. You want to borrow mine? Coffee here, big day. Aww, they're wholesome. I guess you can't judge a book by its cover. Despite there being a dead Koopa body. Hey, is that other dry buds okay? <laughs> He's been collapsed for over an hour. The coffee I made him must be ice cold right now. Hey, cut and break, pal. Him up all night prowling. He big, big exhausted. The night shift, that's rough. So, oh, this is actually really calming. Oh, and we heal too. Okay, yeah. Honestly, I'm just paying for the dialogue at this point. <laughs> Back to the spooky ass music. <gasps> oh! Ooh, okay, a puzzle. Oh, uh, that's not a puzzle. Oh, do I like. What? Oh, there's another opening. Okay. Oh, oh, oh no! It's a toad! Let me show you where to find a sucking treasure! I claim it, but I'm lazy! <laughs> Nice. Any treasure is good treasure. Okay, a similar puzzle, but now there's two openings. Oh my god, how did I fall for the same trick again? Oh, hello? There's two here. Oh. Hold on. Do I have to mimic the same one as the other room? No. I'm trying to see if there's like any hint I can get from this. Or maybe I'm looking too much into things. I was honestly doing every single possible outcome. I had no idea what I was doing. Well, I did, but I also didn't. Well, um, now we get to see the Toad Angel. Oh, the Submarine Marino. Oh, and there's all the collect- I think that's everything then. Yep. Oh, oh, it's just the to- Oh, oh. Uh. <laughs> Look at his little smile. If you seek paradise, gather the three orbs on Diamond Island. Okay. Oh, uh, the fan? Oh no, it's Sticker Star. Oh wait, is it blowing away the fog? Why are there so many thing re references here? We have the steak from earlier, right? And then we have the fan. Oh, and there we go. Uh, Seek and ye shall find. Come, follow me to bed. All right, nope. I think that's my cue to leave. Ooh, this
this sounds like no, Olivia, that's not the. 